I'm going to give you five tips to help you code faster. Okay, I have a program here, the donation program. I have three buttons. When I click on the 10 Rand button, I want to add 10 Rand. When I click on 20, I want to add 20 Rand to the total. When I click on the 50, I want to add 50 Rand to the total. I want to display the total in the label down at the bottom. Okay, so I'll be giving you some tips as I'm coding. Great. First tip that I can give you definitely is when you want to rename your buttons or any object or any component in Delphi, you can select that object. Let's go to the captions. You can actually use tab to, sh to shift the focus to the left hand side here. You will see that the focus is now on the caption. And then if I type in N, it will take me to the property that starts with an N. And then when I click tab again, it will go to the property value. And then I can change that property value. Okay, so for example, let's say you want to change button 2 and you, you are currently on a caption. You don't need to scroll and search for that name property. Okay, so you can quickly just click tab on the keyboard once, then type in the in, tab again, and then you will be in that property and then you can change that name of that object. Okay, that's step one to change uh, properties a little bit faster. Okay, tip number two is if you want to declare variables, you can let Delphi declare the variable for you. Let's make a variable R total. Okay, so I'm going to select that word R total, that variable. Go to refactoring. Then I'm going to go to declare variable. Okay, declare variable. Or the shortcut is shift control V. Okay, so the type, the data type, I want it to be real. Okay, set value. I'm going to give it a starting value. Initialize the value to 0, 0. Okay, so Delphi will do that for me. So it will be a little bit faster, especially if you code or you type a little bit slowly. Okay, so I'm just going to put this one on the, the global. And I'm going to put this, I actually want it to be under form create. Okay, looks like I messed something up here. Yeah. I'm just going to fix this. I want to put it under form create, I total zero. R total is zero rather. Okay, so R total is zero. And when I click on this button, I want to add 20 rand to R total. So tip number three. If you want to copy something like a word, you just double click on the word, control C, control V to paste. Okay, so if you want to copy something quickly double click on the word that means that it will automatically select that word for you so double click on the word control c control v okay control c control v i'm going to say it's equals to control v again plus 20. okay because you don't want to type r total out every time because it's going to take uh, quite amount of time and you might misspell it and then you need to fix it again as well so it's easier control c control v copy and paste it quickly because okay, so i'm adding 20 here and now i want to display that in my label label one dot caption it's equals to control v again float to string f okay, i'm not going to display this occurrence you know okay another thing is you can 
copy and paste a lot make sure you copy paste a lot first one was 10 rand actually or 20 so second one is 20 rand and then the third one is 50 rand Uh, 50 rand, 10, 20, 50 rand. Okay, let's just test this program. Okay, it's not flow to string F. Of course, I'm not changing it to a currency or fixing it here. Okay, so it will just add that amount for me. Okay, so next step. Let's say I want to rename this variable rtotal. I used it actually quite a few times now in this program, but I don't want it to be rtotal anymore. I want it to be something like r amount. Okay, so I want to change it, all of them. So one method can be I can go like this r amount. Remember, double click to select the word, control C, double click, control V, control V, control V. But it, this will still take a bit of my time. So, a shorter method is double click your word or your variable R total, right click, then go to refactoring, and then you can go to rename variable r total shortcut for that one shift control e okay i'm gonna show it again double click to select your variable or your variable name right click go to refactoring go to rename variable to r total okay then old name is r total the new name let's make it r amount or amount okay if this checkbox is checked you can just uncheck it because you don't want to view any references before refactoring say okay and it will change all your R totals to R amounts okay so I think that will save you quite a lot of time if you need to rename something in your Delphi you can do it this way um, so the first step was basically, so remember, select a word by double clicking, control C, control V. You can use uh, Delphi to complete or to create the variables for you and to initialize the variables for you. You can quickly jump to specific properties by using the tab and then the letter of that property. Uh, the fourth tip is you can rename fields or variables quickly by using the refactoring rename variable and then it will rename all the variables for you and the fifth tip that I'm not really going to use in this program but I would really recommend is to use the templates that's available in Delphi so let's say you want you need to create a case statement instead of typing the whole case statement from scratch rather use a template that's already given okay, just double click on the case statement and it will automatically throw in the case statement for you so so it might save you a bit of time how did I get that I went to Okay, firstly select the position where you want to insert the coding then you go to view and then go to templates and then it will display the templates on the right hand side over here you want to need to declare an array or a case statement or a for statement or for with a begin or something like that I would really recommend you use this okay, let's add repeat repeat until and then I can just continue coding and fill in the stuff that I need to add okay so let's go through it again renaming variables or using properties with the tab 
double click control C control V um, use Delphi to declare variables and initialize variables for you rename your variables and then use templates to make your coding a little bit easier and faster